Hey everyone, this is Jacob here at the nursery at Udell again. Uh, just a little over a week ago, we did a video with you all about the cuttings that we stuck in these trays underneath the mist heads to get some roots pushed out. And we said we'd come back with a follow-up video to kind of show you the progress and what stages these plants go through as they're putting the roots out. So this is gonna bother some of you. I'm gonna pull some of these cuttings up to see if they have roots out. So you're on their two sides. You look at them every day like I do, or you're on the side where you don't touch these things until there's roots coming out the bottom of the tray. It doesn't hurt anything. But we're gonna pull this sun patient out. And if you take a look, you can start seeing some little white spots and the end of that cutting has swelled up and they call that the callus. So as this cutting starts to heal on the bottom, it forms a callus, and then that plant will start putting out some adventitious roots, and then those roots will keep going and you'll have a plant that can take care of itself without the aid of the mist. So these plants have been stuck for 12 days, and they're at different stages. We have some euphorbias that have roots out. The lantana has not started. Most of the sun patients have put out roots or getting ready to in the next day or so. The lobelia have roots out. But let's take a look at one of these coleus here and see how much roots they have just in 10 days, 12 days. So this one has two or three coming out. This one has a whole lot more. You can see it. But what I'll do is I'll just get these pushed back in the soil. And then in the next two to three weeks, these will be rooted through enough to where we can transplant them into a bigger container, put them in our greenhouse in the back, give them some fertilizer. And around the middle of May, Sadie and volunteers and Hort staff will be able to put them out and you'll be able to see these growing all summer here at Udell.